agriculture plays an important role in our life, survival, and prosperity. But uh, the, growing, the increasingly growing population has stressed our agricultural sector. And how do farmers uh, meet the huge demand for food because of population growth so quickly? Uh, there are lots of issues facing uh, uh, farmers uh, recently. Um, so one of the most serious problem is the best, how to control the best. So what 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 is the method to control the best? Do you think it's a commonly and popular it's common and popular way to control the best? Pesticide? Yeah that's right. Pesticide ninety percent of people when we're talking about best management they think about pesticide. It's the good and inexpensive way to control the best. But um, the, the best design application, application in agriculture has also questions its effect on environment. And so today, one of the questions is, is pesticide poisoning the environment? Is it to have a negative effect on our environment? So let's uh, look at today, we're going to uh, look at three main points. The first is pesticide and its role in agriculture. Environmental problem pertaining to pesticide that pesticide has some effect on soil, water, and biodiversity. diversity. And the last one I want to discuss about some pros and cons of pesticide application in agriculture. So first, so let's look at this stuff. I go, I want to go quickly for definition of pesticide and how it is. A pesticide is a substance of a mixture of some substances. It is designed to control, to destroy the, the weed species and harmful insects that can destroy the crop. Mm, the pesticides are classified um, in, uh, in, uh, according to um, the target organism. For example, pesticide is a kind of uh, chemical used to control to kill the weed and insecticide of course to kill insects, the harmful insects and uh, fungicides to kill fungi. Yeah. Um we see one hundred and fifty domestic pesticides in Europe. Uh, there are there is um, one hundred forty thousand tons of pesticides are applied in all every year in Europe is a big number of pesticides that we apply in the crop. So why they use a lot of pesticides? Obviously to control the best. And if uh, they successfully control the best, it means that to boost the crop yield to increase the production of the food cycle. And this is the, the benefit of using pesticides. But um, pesticides are uh, a question about their bad side effects on environment too. So there is some problem related to environment that's caused by pesticides. So we first look at the soil, how pesticides affect the soil. Because uh, a lot of pesticide application in soil can reduce soil fertility and the, the, the next result of uh, pesticide on soil is to make the uh, to um, lead to the primary erosion process. Yeah. Uh, you said what are they they are microorganisms, the micro animals that live in the soil. Um, they are present their appearance may be so ugly, but some of them have many important roles in maintaining the soil, the texture and fertility of the soil. A mic microorganisms, what are they? They can be bacteria, fungi, algae, and earthworms that I can, some of them consider to be good and some are, are bad, bad <laughs> bacteria, you know. 
but I, I want to focus on the, the good, the good uh, microorganisms. Their growth in the soil is maintain the productivity, the moisture, and biological structure of the soil. This means that they is the uh, the is the part that decide the fertility level of the soil. So what happens if we use pesticide a lot and if we and pesticide residue remain on the soil? It can alter the pH of the soil, destroy soil structure, and maybe alter the habitat of these micro animals. So pesticide is actually hinder the work of microorganisms because I said before microorganisms play an, an important role in maintaining the fertility of soil. So what can if a lot of microorganisms die, it means to reduce the soil fertility factor. And when the texture and the structure of soil is altered and changed, it can worsen the farmland erosion. That is uh, how pesticide can have the negative effect on our soil. So let's look at the second thing. The uh, pesticide can have negative effect on water too. Uh, agricultural runoff carries the pesticide residue, residues to waterway, and it can lead to poor quality of drinking water. Let's look at the this uh, can be bigger. Uh, when when the the, the crop the crop that kill ingested with pesticides, uh, the residue of pesticides remain on the soil. When it rains, a lot of residue be carried to the waterway. I mean, the the residue he run off to uh, the waterway, like a river creek go to the river that contaminate the water in the river. Uh, the remain of the pesticide on the soil. Page, it means leach into the leach further into the soil and they what guess what? It reaches the round water and the round water come, come to the river and onto uh, also come to the well that and then affect the quality of drinking water. Do we want food or do we want water? <laughs> water. Okay. So uh, the pesticide does cause pests on on soil and water. And another thing is it can put put biodiversity in trouble.
the robin was killed <laughs> indirectly by pesticide. And pesticide is, is uh, also like used for the disappearance of some pollinators like bees and butterflies. Okay. So the third part, I want to look at some controversial research. It is about application of pesticide in agriculture. Other people who in favor of using pesticide also say that pesticide are cost in an inexpensive method to protect the crop against um, harmful insects, boost the agricultural output, uh, output, I'm sorry, to boost the agricultural output. And the downside of effects of, of pesticide is uh, overstated because there are a lot of natural pesticides have been banned, have, have been uh, banned by the government. And they um, they control the, uh, the strict control on um, on pesticide products. So maybe the, the downside effects are overstated. overstated. But uh, pesticides, uh, uh, obviously, is a toxic, a toxic are designed to kill living things. How can you say that a toxic can never be harmful to the living things? Sorry. Um, uh, the short side benefits, the short side benefits of pesticides, maybe to increase uh, the food, to uh, to help farmer achieve the, 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 the high profitable crops or something like this. This is the soft side benefit. It can lure most farmers away from the long run impacts in the environment. And what happens if pesticides? Uh, what happens to uh, when a pesticide when uh, when we overuse a particular kind of pesticide? They uh, become resistant to the to this kind of pesticide. I mean the insecticide resistant when when uh, uh, one particular pesticide fail to control uh, one one particular pest, the number of this kind, the number of insects increase, and then we may we cause a loss in the crop yield. So in conclusion, that um, pesticides may be promised the high profitable crops. However, can it promise the the sustainable natural habitat for our next generation? My answer is no. Pesticides is, is actually to posing threat on our environment. And um, this is a question for the government to to have the to have the way the method how to control the usage of pesticides in agriculture. There's still another alternative method to control pests. Uh, to interrupt interrupt to the the insect weed, weeding circle or to use a uh, uh, to see a uh, crop rotation crop rotation yeah. not 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 uh, don't